Hey there guys, this is frank o -Matic with part 3 of Let's Play Wonder Project J. If I sound a little flustered, it's because I've already lost the intro to this. Um, basically, we're in this chapter learning to farm to make the grumpy old farmer happy. I'm also annoyed because Pino keeps breaking the goddamn tools we need. So I have to keep reloading because we don't have a way of making money yet. Anyways, the three tasks involved with farming are hoeing. We'll see how he does with that. Oop. Planting seeds. Which, obviously, he doesn't care much for. No. And being nice to animals. Something else he fails at, obviously. Hey, don't come crying to me. You deserve that, you old dick. But anyways, it's come to my attention that the trading parts are boring, so I'm going to just show you the new feature that I meant to show you before I uh, accidentally wiped over my save before I went there. <coughs> we can go to town now. And in town... We can go into the shop. Which is basically a big computer. You scroll around, pick what you want, and then he sells it to you. Isn't that great? But anyways, since I know the training part of watching me make Pino use the same item hundreds of times is boring, we are now going to travel through time. When you blink your eyes and come back... Years worth of training... will have happened in mere seconds, and you will never know. Here we go! Just because I'm sure some of you would like to see how much of a dick Pino actually is. Oh, of course, now he starts actually listening to me, but he was giving me the, uh... Hey, look, he figured out how to use the hoe. <laughs> Fuck, that wasn't what I wanted to do. I hope he still does it. Oh good, I didn't screw it up. Okay. Of course, he acted like a dick when I wasn't filming, and now he stopped doing that, but, uh... Anyways, back to the training. Be, Be right back. And here's Pino acting like a dick during the training again. Notice how no matter what I point him at... Stop moving, damn it. Oh, now he started lifting weight with the chickens. But did you see how he told me he hates me? Just because that amuses me. Anyways, back to the training. See what happens when you get him... <laughs> when you get him a little too stressed out? Now he won't do anything. All he'll do is tell me how much he hates me. You know what? I'm not too fond of you either, Pino. You know. I'm gonna try and get this sorted out off screen. I'll be right back. And like magic, we're ready to finally do this. You may notice I sound a little annoyed. I kind of am. We are out a lot of money. Because Pino decided that would be more fun to destroy about eight bags of seeds by eating them, rather than learning how to use them properly. And here's Old Man Fam. He is one ugly son of a bitch. I like how his cow has sunglasses, too. And I'm not really sure why Pino is serenading him. But, uh... Fam ignores it to, uh... 
decide to let him farm for him. Yes, we know how to use these things. At least I really hope you fucking do. Coincidentally, that actually counts as being kind to animals. That was the only thing I could get him to do rather than the normal kind action, so I just ran with it. Oh, good. He's hoeing properly. I like how hitting the ground once makes a nice, perfectly even tilled soil for him, too. And then the hoe dies, I guess. And he spread the seeds. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, boy, come here. He looked really pissed off, didn't he? Not anymore, though. I'm sorry for all the rough treatment. I've been waiting for a boy to come along some time now. Blah, blah, blah. A heart that loves nature. A love for nature that no one here has had since the war 50 years ago, which nobody has mentioned to us, but, you know, that's fine. I've been waiting for a boy with such a heart. Yes, Pino is now a farming slave. If only he were farming gold like the Chinese do in WoW. I'm sorry, that was a, ra that was a racist joke. And now we can make money. That's a, uh, helpful thing, and I'm going to be doing it because I lost a lot of money. Because I had to buy an item. Oh, what's this? Well, well. We've finally taken our first step towards true ultimate power. We've activated the first heart circuit for Circuit J. Only a bunch fucking more to go. Yes, it did go great. If you don't count all the bullshit that you made me go through to do it. And selling them, it'll bring in good money, which we need really badly. And yes, luck actually does make a difference in this. But anyways... <sighs> That was part three. Coming back for part four, where hopefully Pino will quit being such a little dick.